This little product here is a huge update on something that I had showed you guys a few weeks ago that's going to help with your Tesla's anti-nag. Stick around. I'm going to go ahead and show you how this little device here is going to change your Tesla's driving experience. What is happening? Automotive Fanatics, it's Peter, your Automotive Fanatic, coming at you guys with a product update on something that I have installed in the past. Those of you that have followed my channel know that a few weeks ago I installed a anti-nag device from a company called Evor and they reached out to me to offer an update. Now this product is going to be once again the anti-nag but the version is the TSL6 and it's actually an improvement over the 1, 2, and 3 that um, Evor had designed. This installation process is much easier to install. Prior to the installation that we'll do today, you guys noticed before, the installation was actually behind the steering wheel controllers. This one is going to be an OBD connection that sits behind the air vent in the rear passenger seat. So you have this little um, connector here, and then you have the little, believe it or not, this is the little module that just connects right into here. But I'll show you a little more in depth once we get to the installation process. But what Evor had mentioned is with this installation here, it's easier, it works better because it is an updated version. So without further ado, I am going to go ahead and install this in a Model Y. However, it will also work in the Model 3. So let's go ahead and get to this installation. So you're going to take the supplied uh, plastic trim removal, you'll put it underneath here and essentially pull this off just like that. It's held by these clips so you'll be fine. Taking a look at the OBD connection here, what you're going to do is you're going to push down on this little plastic piece here using the prying tool. I would recommend that you guys just simply kind of turn it like such to to kind of loosen this up here. And again, this one is very tight. And you see how that kind of pulled out? Just push this out, and then you're gonna go ahead and pull this connector out. This is essentially just a daisy chain. So all you're going to do is, it is idiot proof. So you'll turn it around, snap this one in, make sure it locks in. And then this one here will go on this side. Same thing, it is idiot proof in terms of how it's supposed to go in. All right, you heard it click. This one is clicked in as well. And here is that little controller that you see right there. Now we are essentially done with this install. You'll have to essentially uh, kind of torque these around a little bit. And then from there, you'll take the cover and you'll put it right back and you are pretty much done with this install. Getting back to how I put it together, again, all I did was I just aligned those little pins. You push and it will lock in. As you can see, it's a nice clean install, nothing bulges out, and that is how it should look. With the anti-nag device installed, I am happy to report back to you guys after the initial testing of the vehicle, it proved itself worth its weight in gold. It works as advertised. Now with this new version, the installation is very simplified. You don't have to take the steering wheel off. You just have to take that one lower panel off and then you connect them and you are pretty much done at that point. 
if you guys are interested, I will go ahead and include a link below with my discount code so that you can get a nice discount to purchase the product from Evor. As I had mentioned in the prior product that I installed, this really defeats the Tesla's safety system. I'm not responsible for you guys using it, so use it at your best judgment. This is truly just an install video that I am making for you guys to show you how to use and to install uh, the little device in your Tesla. And as usual, my automotive fanatic family, I appreciate you dropping by, checking out this short video for the Evor's anti-nag. Until the very next time, my automotive fanatic family, this is Peter, your automotive fanatic, signing off. <laughs>